Stop. Answer this. Have you ever felt overwhelmed? Unable to break free from a cycle of self-doubt? Looking for a quick and effective way to rewire your negative thinking in 30 seconds? I've got you covered with an ancient and science-backed tip that can change your life. Ever heard of the pause framework inspired by the wisdom of Marcus Aurelius? In just a few minutes, I will demonstrate how this simple yet powerful tool can transform your life. Meet Marcus Aurelius, the philosopher, emperor of ancient Rome, whose writings continue to inspire us with timeless wisdom on resilience, self-discipline, and the power over our minds and over external circumstances. His meditations, a private journal of Stoic philosophy, taught how to live in accordance with nature's rational order. In his words, the present moment is all you have and all you will ever have. He also wrote, when you arise in the morning, think of what a precious privilege it is to be alive, to breathe, to think, to enjoy, to love. Drawing upon the insights of Marcus Aurelius, the pause framework is a simple yet powerful tool derived from Stoic philosophy that helps individuals reframe negative thoughts and take control of their lives. When you encounter a negative situation or thought, remember, pause. Let's explore the framework, and then we will explore each step. Wait until the end. We will share a secret to increase your chances of success. Pause. P is pause and take a breath. A, assess your thoughts. U, understand your emotions and why you're feeling this way. S, shift your focus to positive thoughts. E, engage in positive self-talk. Again, P for pause, A for assess thoughts, U for understand emotions and feelings, S for shift to positive thoughts, and E, engage in positive self-talk. Pause, assess, understand, shift, and engage. Let's explore further. Pause and take a breath. Research suggests that taking a few deep breaths can help regulate the autonomic nervous system and help reduce anxiety and stress levels in as little as 30 seconds. You have the power over your mind, not outside of this. Realize this and you will find strength. Marcus Aurelius. He also wrote, very little is needed to make a happy life. It is all within yourself and your way of thinking. Again, pause and take a breath. A, assess your thoughts. Studies have shown that simply becoming aware of negative thoughts and assessing their accuracy can help reduce their impact on our emotions and our behavior. Marcus wrote, the happiness of your life depends upon the quality of your thoughts. Assess your thoughts. You understand your emotions and why you're feeling this way. Understanding and labeling emotions can decrease their intensity. Marcus, as astute as he was, wrote, if you are pained by any external thing, it is not the thing that disturbs you, but your own judgment about it. And it is in your power to wipe out that judgment now. S, shift your focus to positive thoughts. Studies indicate that intentionally focusing on positive thoughts and emotions increases happiness and well-being. Here's from Meditations, the book by Marcus Aurelius. He wrote, the soul becomes dyed with the color of its thoughts. And the things that you think about determine the quality of your mind. And lastly in the pause framework is engage. Engage in positive self-talk. Self-talk, which research has shown that practicing this positive self-talk can improve mood and self-esteem. Focus only on what is within your control and let go of everything else. Again, drawing from the wisdom of Marcus Aurelius, you have power over your mind, not outside of this. Realize this, and you will find strength. This advice alone will reduce stress and anxiety. As he said, the happiness of your life depends on the quality of your thoughts. Each person has a unique processing time for thoughts and emotions, and it's perfectly fine if it takes some a little longer than others. In fact, studies suggest that mindfulness practices, that is, observing thoughts and emotions without judgment, of about 10 to 15 minutes a day, can increase emotional regulation, meaning our ability to better regulate and control our emotions. Here's that secret tip that I mentioned earlier. First, remember, pause. Pause, assess, understand, shift, and engage. And then, a little known tip from Marcus Aurelius is the importance of focusing on the present moment, not dwelling on the past or worrying about the future, but living in the presence. He emphasized the power of living in the moment and making the most of each experience as it's happening, rather than letting our thoughts and fears hold us back. Focus solely on what you can do presently, right now. 